Today I have set myself the challenge of trying to build an actual walking robot. This is going to be tricky because I don't know where to start with this, so I'm just going to build- Oh, well, I was going to build a leg, but then I ran out of bits. More bits, please. Mmm, bits. Put those bits on there. That's, uh, that's basically a leg, right? And then I'm going to assume that at some point- Oh, uh, hang on. I'm going to need a joint, something to join it up. Let's make it an uneven number so the joint is right in the middle. And then we can delete these little bitties right here and make it hollow because I think this stuff weighs us down and what we don't want is a really heavy robot because then it won't go anywhere. Actually, no, that's too chunky. And you know what we do with bits we don't want or need? I'm gonna, I'm gonna throw the bits that I don't want or need and then just let her rip. Whee! Oh, yes! <laughs> See you later, leg. Don't need you anymore. Uh, also, trebuchet don't need you anymore. So, thinner leg than that. I don't know why I'm starting with the leg. It just makes more sense. If I'm gonna be walking, the main thing I need is a leg. Otherwise, I ain't going nowhere. Right, we can hinge these together. And there we go. Done. Got a leg. That's all. Oh. Oh, that bends in some unpleasant ways. I think if we're going to make a leg, we probably need a piston to kind of push and pull them together. Okay, so it's got a bendy knee, and when I contract the piston, it'll bend. That's not too bad. And then I, hang on, I need to set up the bits that make it work. So there's a boiler w that we need. I think it'll be easier if we just put the pipes like that there. Oh, and then I need controls. So just for testing, I'm gonna put controls right on top of it. Not normally where your controls go, they're just normally all the way up here, but seeing as we've only got a leg right now, I'm going to be using just the leg. Whoa. Flying is hard. Have you ever tried flying? Okay, so we got that's down, and that's up. Whoa! That's a powerful kick you got there. Okay, and we can do that while walking, probably. Oh, oh dear. Uh, I think the smartest thing would be to save this so that we don't have to build another one. We can just copy-paste. Right, give me one more. Give me one more, and then I connect- Whoa! And then I can connect them, and we can have two legs doing the same thing. Wait, can we have, like, a, a hip joint? so we can put them both together. I don't know what I'm doing for a foot, by the way, but I'll figure that out later. Uh, let's just assume that we got a, a woman robot because this hip is wide. Hey, they, that even looks like legs. Good, oh, your hips, your hips don't lie because they're telling me they're upside down. That's bad. <laughs> let's try this. Oh, yeah, there we go. That's a powerful wide stance you got there. Um, I just realized I'm gonna need something similar to this, um, piston setup, connecting the hip to the thigh. But already, we've got legs, and they look like legs, and they kind of, hang on, work like legs. Let's press E. Whoa! Okay, no, they don't, they don't work like legs. <laughs> I've never turned myself inside out by, by trying to walk. Oh, hang on! This robot is down on one knee. Is it already proposing to me? I am so charming. I can I can be proposed to by a robot. Well, where's your ring? Da 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 da. I'm getting married to a robot. That's not something I ever expected to say. How do I put this on? Uh oh. Did I just connect? I accidentally connected my ring to the thigh of the robot. Let's get rid of. Um, I'm gonna put this over here for safekeeping, just in case I lose it. There we go. So when it contracts. It's, it's like bending its knee all the way up so it can then... Da -da -da, da -da -da -da. It's not very attractive. Let's start by putting a controller here. Wait, don't connect to the piston. There we go. Ooh, that looks a bit rude, doesn't it? <laughs> because this robot doesn't have a head yet, can't do any thinking with a brain. It's apparently doing all the controlling from the crotch. No wonder it's already proposed to me. One, one spunky robot. So you know how some people are like, robots of the future? I think they're right. Especially for lonely people like me who apparently need to build their own girlfriend. This is what I'm doing. This is... <laughs> I just realized I'm trying to build my own girlfriend because, uh, I've already tried to marry it 
and it's got a, a thing going on in the crotch region. It's it's not looking good for me. I'm looking look like a creeper, which is bad, very bad. Oh well, let's keep going. <laughs> Why not? Okay, okay, I, th I think I've got it. It even kind of looks like legs. No, don't collapse. I have an idea though, to stop it collapsing. Let's, uh, oh God. Un untangle it from its legs. This is bad. This is really bad. <laughs> your, your entire hip region is upside down. Oh, it looks like it's running though. That's kind of cool. Oh dear. Oh dear. Okay. Arise, my creation! <laughs> it lives! Come on! Yes. It's starting to move. My creation has life! Yes! Arise! <laughs> it lives! And floats! Yes! Okay, now I won't have to worry about it falling over quite so much. Oh no! Uh, I dropped off the pistons, now we're flying away. <laughs> There's gonna be a giant sky crotch and everyone's like, uh, why is there a wang in the sky? I don't know! Hang on. Okay. <laughs> Do you need a wee? Because you look like you're crossing the legs. Okay, I fixed it, and I think I even made it better because now I can easily connect all of the things together. Let's cable these up so they can be controlled from one place. I've got legs. I've got legs that can walk. I haven't got feet or or arms or a head, but look, I can I can make it. Do I can make it jump? Kind of. Look, it's got. Ugh, uh, eh, 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 eh. It can do a kind of weird jumpy frog dance. Yeah! The pinnacle of robotics is complete. Now I have this. Oh, oh, did that look a little bit like walking? I think it did. This will make all those dynamo and cyber motion robots jealous. Let's put arms on, make it a proper robot. Uh, up here? Yeah. Oh, it's very heavy. <laughs> It looks like it's giving up, like, uh, uh, what is even the point? Oh, I missed. I didn't, I didn't get the arm on properly. It's, it's become Marvin the Paranoid Android. It's like, uh, what's the point? There we go. We've got a proper robot. Oh, wait, get up, mate. You've got, you've got your adoring public. <laughs> there we go. There's the marriage proposal. Oh. It hasn't got a head, so this is gonna be weird, but alas, poor Yorick. Wait, I've got- I've got the perfect thing. Come on, propose to me. Here is the ring. <laughs> yes, I now have a robot bride, which is still creepy. But if I'm gonna do any more robots on my channel, and I'm gonna need to marry one, there's logic in there somewhere. What does it look like walking? The pistons aren't strong enough to push itself up. Uh, no, it's collapsing. Come on, stand up! I know you can do it! Uh, not with your legs, but with your balloons! That thing that everybody has to help them stand up. My internal balloons are working very well, thank you, even though I'm sat down. Hey! It's working! And... Jump! We got the jumping down. The jumping is the one thing that this robot can do really, really well. Jump! Uh, what? I think we've got too many balloons. We're, we're floating away. I think we're too good at jumping because we are currently floating away. Okay, bye-bye! Bye-bye! <laughs> Okay. <laughs> okay, you're gonna have to come back down to earth at some point. 
Thank you so much for watching. If you have any ideas for additions to this robot, then let me know in the comments or on my Discord. You should also subscribe because I would love to show you building games where we can make and break physics-y stuff together and inspire you to be creative. But until next time, mustache.